Tech Tiger Academy, welcome guys. This is Ravi Malhotra, your instructor for this entire series. This is going to be lecture number 15 and this is real lab number 7. In this lab, I'm actually going to tell you how do you configure ICA management tool just because we know that, you know, the ICA management tool is disabled by default. Just please um, look into the last video where there is entire theory on the ICA management tool. Now, this is disabled by default, port number 18265. So there are a lot of things that you have to do in a series in order to configure ICA management tool. This is what I'm going to show you in this video, right? So ICA management tool is disabled by default. That's right. ICA management tool needs port number 18265 in listening mode on the security management server. Try to connect to the management of a browser with port number 18265. This is what we'll do. But you will not be able to connect as it is disabled by default. Perform these actions to enable it and configure it. So first of all, I will create an administrator with certificate. I will store that certificate, right? So I'm going to access my smart dashboard. That's my dashboard. I'll go to manage and settings. And then I'll right click here. I'll click on new. And I will give it a name Tech Tiger Academy CA Admin, right? CA Admin for Tech Tiger Academy. That's a set new password. Give it a password here. All right. Just uncheck this box. Uh, set new password. Let me give it again. Capital P at. So I have unchecked this option. Okay. Certificate is not defined. I'm going to create a certificate. Give a password for the certificate and make sure that you you store the password somewhere so that you can recall it when needed next i'm going to uh, let's let, let me save it as you know tech tiger academy ca admin it is a star.p12 file okay permission profile is going to be it's a read write because it's an administrator and just click on OK. So the first so so now we will do two things guys. The one is that this is the administrator that we have created Tech Tiger Academy CA admin. Just right click and view on this. That's it right. So certificate is defined we can click over here and we can view this this is what you need to copy for when when we will do the next command that's okay so just click on close uh, let me let me just let me just copy that right so that's a view and that's my CN I'm just copying it okay next thing i'll do is that i will have to install the certificate in my browser so i'll give a command cert manager.msc in the cert manager.msc i'm going to import uh, so i'll just go to i'll highlight personal folder i'll click on action i'll click on uh, actions i'll click on find certificates All task options right 
right so certificate is created this is on the desktop now what I'm going to do I'm just going to launch my Firefox okay uh, just go to options then go to privacy and security inside the privacy and security you will see an option for certificates here you see uh, just click on view certificates so few certificates are already there I need to import the new one the new one is the TTA CCA admin right this is the one that we have created today I will click on open it will ask me for a password give it the same password guys the password entered was incorrect okay let me try again okay done so uh, TTA CA admin certificate has been imported into this browser so just uh, click on view this is how you see that this is the certificate guys right so we can close it now once we close it we, we will click on OK so let me go to the slide now so we said that access the security management server over the dashboard done create a new administrator with the certificate that's done save the certificate on the desktop done install import it using cert manager ut utility done once administrator is created view its certificate and copy its CN value done access the security management server over putty in expert mode and give the following command tool to check the status of the ICA management tool right so next I'm going to open my putty I will access 192.168.200.50 uh, that's my IP address of the management server I will log in done right I will log into the expert mode exactly now we are logged into the expert mode guys okay um, I need to give a command to enable the ICA management tool the command is that you know cpca underscore client space set underscore management underscore tool on hyphen a and then here you need to paste the cn value so i copied it i just right click over here and i'll say yes the moment you click on ok you need to read the results carefully it says that management tool is on it says that it is using ssl that's the second line in the third line it says that the authorized administrator is tta uh, ca admin okay authorized users authorized custom users and all that in case if you want to authorize to uh, one another administrator what will you do guys what will you do is that let's say that I want to make ICA admin right as an administrator I will double I will just open this user I will click on view uh, I will copy this uh, certificate CN value I will go back here I will say cpca underscore client set underscore management underscore tool on hyphen a and do this it is on right so it, it says that the authorized administrator now is that ICA admin right and this is I have just given the command back now I have made TTA TTA CA admin to be the default administrator to have an access over there right this is on now in case if I want to see the status so the command is that cpca underscore client set underscore management underscore tool print and we can see that now let's go back to the PPT it says that do this this is done this is done this is done now we will try to connect to the browser over so that's my browser HTTPS 192.168.200.50 colon 18265 very good now it will ask you for the certificate the certificate I created is that TTA CA admin I'll click on OK 
here you go guys so now we see that you know we are connected to the ICA management tool over port number 18265 let me see what we have done we created an administrator with the certificate we installed the certificate we copied the CN value of the certificate we connected to the security management server over putty we entered into the expert mode we give this command cpca underscore client set management tool on hyphen a and the cn of the administrator and we have also done this command and now we are able to connect to this right so guys here now you can do multiple operations just click on search and you will be able to see all the certificates that's the tta ca admin that's the one you created and this is the dn for this um, certificate that's the serial number of the certificate right um, if you just want to search with a specific name only let's say that ICA admin just click enter and you will only see the ICA admin if you want to see Tech Tiger Academy CA admin you will be able to see that specific certificate right you can even create a certificate you can configure the CA you can manage the SRLs you know that all the certificates with which have been um, kind of uh, uh, which have been you know uh, which have been revoked right all the certificates will be shown over here so that's all guys so this slide is done let me move to the next slide next slide is that search for all the certificates on the ICA management tool this is what we have done command to disable the ICA management tool that's the command to disable ICA management tool let me go back to the command prompt cpca underscore client set underscore management underscore tool off done the moment you say off it will say that management tool is off now so now you will not be able to connect to it so the moment you will do refresh the screen right see that we are not able to connect if we are not able to connect that means that the port number 18265 is also not responding so if I do telnet if I do telnet localhost 18265 see that it says connection refused let me let me just try to okay command to enable ICA management tool again for an administrator so I will just give that command again CPCA set management tool for this administrator TTA hit enter and command to see the status CPCA set underscore management underscore tool print you will be able to see that management tool is on using SSL so that means now if you do that this it says that connected to the local host right that's the one check and second thing is that you will be able to connect to it now over a browser fine guys that's a bonus lab please just just do it carefully command to see the status command to see which administrator is allowed to ICA management tool look for authorized administrator this is this is what you need to do um, print the authorized administrator is this right here you see that to remove an administrator from ICA management tool just give this command um, remove I'll say cpca underscore client set underscore management underscore tool remove hyphen a remove hyphen a I'm just going to copy this CN so it it says remove so I'll say CPCA underscore client set underscore management underscore tool remove done so this administrator is now removed that you know so if, if you give a command print now you will see that it is showing nothing right so but if you just want to enable it back and to remove all users run the command clean so, so to remove all users I'll say cpca underscore client 
set underscore management underscore tool clean done so now everything in, including administrators users custom users all will be removed right i will not be able to connect to ICA management tool but if you just want to enable it back so then the command is cpc underscore client set management tool on hyphen a and the cn that's all great this is done let me try to refresh my browser very nice guys I I got connected I can search I can create certificates I can do all these different operations so wonderful guys it was a it's a bonus lab guys just please do this lab along with me you will be able to learn checkpoint in effective way please follow all my videos uh, please subscribe to my channel it's my request and please like view comments right and just please forward it to all your friends for the learning that's all guys uh, in the next video we will just talk about the sick process how do you establish the sick how do you break how do you re-establish the sick that's all guys have a wonderful day to you and uh, have a great day guys bye